Oh, here we go again. Oh. So it's a bit of low tide that one. So I got a bit of a hill to get up. Quite an eventful crossing. I'll, uh, as long as they're recorded okay, I'll, oh, hello, coming down the one way. Yeah, as long as it recorded okay, I'll uh, put that up. But we had, um, uh, as it was low tide, we had to go the long way round, but it followed the coast along the front of the Isle of Wight for quite a long time. Longer than I've seen for a, well, I would say ever, but that might be a lie. Um, yeah, so all the way along the front, past the ride pier head with the fast cut docks, and then we saw the hovercraft from Hover Travel taken off, steaming by. Then there was a military vessel docked up. And then uh, when we got a bit closer in, again we followed the coast, coming into... Sorry, I was just looking at what's going on there. Uh, we followed the coast. In Portsmouth, coming along the South Sea. And then as we got in, there was a big siren and a fire alarm was going off. And a big evacuation notice, so you can see all them people down there. And what we passed a minute ago, so they're all obviously been evacuated. I'm not sure where it was coming from, somewhere in Gumworth. But yeah, it's all, all kicking off. It's a lovely morning again. Beautiful. But you still do need another layer. Oh, there he, he went straight for a red light. He wasn't going to wait. Terrible. They give us cyclists a bad name, they do. Always effing and jeffing and going through red lights. Don't believe it. I mean, what did he gain? Two seconds? And then we got a few jaywalkers up ahead. What are they doing? Are they beelining or are they just going to get in my way? Come on. Popular old university, this one. There always seems to be a lot of people around, especially at this time. Oh, that was a bit of good timing. Just got to weep my frame through, through the crowd. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And we're through. Oh. Sometimes you can wait a long time for that light. So it was lucky me. We did obviously really pressed it and it just turned as I got there. Oh, very, very dazzling. Hopefully the cars behind me can see. Oh, I can barely see. Right, we got some lights and some people crossing. Green for me. I'm going. Weep my way around the man carriers. And we's off. Yeah, so rather eventful. Considering. Considering what normally happens, bugger all. Oh, and also, just before I got to the ferry this morning, there'd been a car accident. So I might... Don't know if I can add that onto the end of this one. Because I wasn't recording. Stupid, really. I mean, it's not the type of thing you want to record anyway, but... 
if I'm going and something happens, it's there. Obviously I'm not night crawling, running out, trying to find some action, recording it. So I did press record as I got up to the queue, because I thought, oh, I wonder what's going on here, think something of interest, but as I got to it, no, it was a car accident. So I feel a bit bad now for recording it. But I'm just like a journalist, I'm just showing what I see. Just like a journalist. It wasn't a particularly bad one. It looks like someone was just coming out of their house. And then, I guess with this sun, another car I didn't see and just clipped them on the wing. Everyone seemed to be out their cars. Bit of glass on the road. But that's about it. Oh. Yeah, I expect I'll clip it onto the end of this one just so you can see if anyone's interested. Oh, shame my camera wouldn't have picked that up. There's a uh, queue of cars just down that road where that lorry was coming out. And they're all stuck behind some gentleman in his little mobility scooter. I don't know the rules of the road regarding mobility scooters, but he was in the middle of it. I can't imagine that's right. Right, let's see what this lorry's doing. Is it going to see me or is it going to ram me up the arse? Oh, he's in the other lane. Oh, typical, just got here and everyone's coming this way. Ah, that's lucky. I was a bit close, really. But the, the lorry's coming regardless, so nothing's coming around. Oh, look at this queue. I need to get over to that lane. Well, I don't like to do it until after this junction, in case some idiot's not looking. Oh, right, nothing's coming. Check behind, and I can't get over. Check behind again, I can't get over. I'm just going to have to go. Oh, he wasn't going to wait. See if they're going to wait for me. They are. Very kind. Is this going to go red? No, it's not. I'm froze. Ah, oh dear. Got a bit of a headwind this morning, so I'm not going to put a bit more effort in. But to be fair, I'm always huffing and puffing. Got them out as much stamina as a snail. Poor. Oh. That's a smelly smell. Almost like burning rubber. Oh, I don't know where that's coming from. That's strong. Pungent. That's what it is. That's the word. Pungent. Whew. Oh, it's starting to dissipate. Oh, I'm just getting used to it. It's probably burnt my nostril out. Right. Is this Nissan got a shoot round? No, he got too close. He got too close. He couldn't do the manoeuvre even if he wanted to. So... Sucks to be it. Oh, but he wasn't happy with that, was he? No, he'd waited for 10 seconds, so how dare you pull out in front of me? Now he's chasing him down the street. <sighs> so go, so go. happening there? Bit of a queued up, it's not usually, usually queued up along here. Oh dear, we got a bit of some hazards going on. Oh dear, oh dear. That's not good. Oh, smashed right into the side. Oh no. That's bad. This has just happened. Looks like everyone's okay though. Not nice. It's a problem with these roads. Maybe with the dazzling sun. I thought they could make the move.
going to move over slightly here so people can get by me. But I'm going to have to come out. That's not what you want to see in the morning. Well, even though it looked like it just happened, it's already caused quite a big tail back in that direction at least. Obviously by the time I caught it in my side, there was only a few cars. Oh, oh. hello. People are all in a rush this morning. Well, I think I can hear the sirens. So that's a very quick response. But from what I could see, everyone was out their cars. So we're now coming down the approach to the ferry in Fishbourne, which you've done every day, but there are a few videos showing this. So as I said before, it's the road splits into two here, so anyone needing to get around a bike can do so now easily, especially when the other side's blocked up with traffic. Left side for the ferry, right side straight over. It's not often you see a site like that on the commute. And if you're going to see it, you expect to see it at the Portsmouth side. But hey, at least everyone was okay. One of my colleagues was telling me about a uh, car in Portsmouth which overtook another car. And as it overtook the car, it went straight into a... Um, Cyclist. That was a fatality. So, just always got to have eyes in the back of your head. And even if you do, you can't avoid something like that. Because it would have been instantaneous. Looks like the ferry's in. But not off yet. Oh, that was a big bump. I wasn't watching. No wonder I got a bad back. <laughs> 